Hi, I'm Austin Zimmerman, product specialist here at Houston Metal Sawing, Houston's premier metal sawing and processing facility. Houston Metal Sawing has been in the industry for over 50 years and we've tackled anything from small all the way to big like this 36 inch piece of carbon steel. This piece of carbon steel is 36 inches in OD with a two inch wall. It's actually pretty ductile being a low carbon steel coming in at a 1018, so it should be pretty easy to cut. To start out our cutting process, we're going to be using sawbladedata.com. Sawbladedata.com gave us a good start baseline with 190 feet per minute on the blade speed and it's going to tell us that we can cut 8 to 12 square inches a minute. So even being such a big round, we already knocked this piece out in 16 minutes. To help us do the job, we're going to be putting this big old 36 inch tube on our 60 inch hem saw with a 2 and 5 eighths blade and it's equipped with a Q1002 triple chip carbide blade. Typically, a triple chip blade is not needed in such a low carbon content steel, but we have it equipped, that way we don't even have to ever think about chasing the blade out when doing numerous cuts. Another thing that's going to aid us in the cutting process is the use of the C5200 sawing fluid. The C5200 fluid has good lubricators and a nice detergent package that's going to keep this carbon steel cool and the machine and the part clean and clear of chips and debris. Lastly, the best thing to use when keeping precise cuts in carbon steel is a good industrial carbide guide like you can find at sawblade.com. Here at Houston Metal Song, you'll see us change our industrial guides out possibly three times a year to keep up with the high production and the demand of quality that our customers deserve. Like I said, sawbladedata.com is a great engine to use whether you're in the home fabricating industry or in a high production situation. We use it here at Houston Metal Sawing to start all our cutting processes to make sure that we're fast and efficient to keep up with our customer's demand. The chip is a great indication to tell us how that cut is doing throughout the whole entirety of the cut process. If you notice that the chip is overheating, if it's turning over straw brown, turning blue, you've probably got too much feet per minute on the blade speed, so you want to slow that blade down. If you're noticing that the chips are breaking up, also you probably have a too high of a blade speed, or if the chips are too tightly wound, you probably have an overfeeding issue. You want to make sure that the chips are a straw brown with a nice, decent, healthy curly cue, and that's going to be the indication that you're cutting this 1018 at the best possible capabilities that you can with the blade that you have on hand. Like I said, Houston Metal Sawing has been in the industry for over 50 years, and we have an enormous capacity. We have everything from 3 8 all the way to 5 foot cut capacities, and we service everything with our 25 ton crane. So if you're needing a quote, log on to HoustonMetalSawing.com or give us a call.